Thank you very much for the, the invitation. I'm... Gerardo, yes. just click on the share screen next on the... No, the share, no, the full presentation. Like this? Thank you. It's okay. It's okay. 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 Um, well, thank you very much for the invitation and I hope um, this is a very nice presentation uh, that uh, that uh, I hear. So, well, I try to, to explain uh, a little bit the what is the, the the site, the archaeological site, and then I'll show you two um, two ways that we create to this to improve the knowledge um, between the scientific uh, speech and the uh, relationship with this uh, uh, with this speech with the community and the young people so um, Tosas, um, the necropolis of Tosas, it's um, a very nice place is located in uh, garganta i show you later the the geographic uh, uh, spot uh, this is a very complex site is um, it's a um, it's a it's a it's a small project well it's not a small it's a four year project approved by the direção geral do patrimonio cultural it's something like the general general Directorate of Portuguese Cultural Heritage, the um, check all the archaeological projects projects in Portugal. Uh, so we uh, this, uh, this what uh, is what is the, the, the archaeological site? The archaeological site it, site it's a too complex site because we have a medieval necropolis, we have a possible uh, old chapel dedicated to Santa Maria de Armas. Hermes, it's a, it's a very old and very ancient uh, um, name. So we have also um, a sar um, workshop, workshop, sarcophagus. This, uh, this, in this place, they um, create and, and uh, manufacture the sarcophagus. So we have also a tomb uh, excavated in the rock. This is also a military uh, ter a territory for the military order of uh, of Malta um, the, that helps to the Portuguese king, the, fir the first Portuguese king to the conquest the territory in the in the 12th century. So we have also a medieval rule and then we have also a Neolithic context in the same place with Neolithic pottery. So, and also we have some um, like uh, standing stones or menus or some orthostats in granite, in granite. So, and we have also, as you as you will see later, um, these uh, standing stones promote the summer solstice. So we will check later. So it's located in the village of Garganta in San Martín de Anta, in the municipality of Sabrosa, in the district of Vila Real, in the Alto Douro uh, wine region. So that is the is the, the place, the spot. So um, it's in the north of Portugal. So, and this is a picture that, uh, well, it's not a picture, it's a draw. So, but we will check the picture of the site we have now, until now, uh, maybe 50 or 50 in this part of the, of the, of the picture, standing stones. But we have uh, uh, more than this. So I will show you a picture of the site. This is the site. This is the archaeological site. This is the Serra do, Serra do Meio in the, in the back. And... Um, um, we have, uh, as I said, we have uh, lots of uh, um, uh, 
functionalities in the in the place. So we have a sarcophagus of Tosas made in granite like this. Uh, on the left, on the right, we have the rock rock uh, rock um, rock tomb, and uh, in the middle and in the in the left, we have two uh, sarcophagus. And one in the in the center is double one, and we have um, uh, all the all the manufacturing process of this kind of uh, sarcophagus. Uh, as I said, we have here in the the the, the, the archaeological site as a, a kind of a historical query. So they cut the stones to make the sarcophagus. This is one example, this is another one, and this is another one. So they cut the rocks on the top of the hill and then bring the, the rocks to the to the valley. We have also a standing stones. Uh, we, we call it the uh, Menires, Pedras Fincadas, or uh, Ortostatus. It's something like this. Uh, we have... Uh, 19, 15, uh, between 15 and 19, and 90 uh, uh, standing stones in the in the site. And this is the the map of the site. This is the short map. So I will show you the relationship between the standing stones. This is the the square. This is a, this is the archaeological area. So we we will uh, we 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 excavate. The last year and this year, we excavated these uh, two areas, and we have also the um, summer solstice vector. And we'll check to the, this year in the 21 of June. We check we we in the last year and this year, we we check this uh, this um, this vector in the place. So it's also. We found um, a walls, maybe a walls of the medieval chapel. I show you an example. This is the archaeological area. This is the walls of an ancient chapel, like this. Sorry. Okay. This is very important is because. Uh, this chapel, this chapel. It's, uh, maybe we 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 made some. Uh, um, that thing uh, use we use your um, OLS optical stimulating uh, light, and uh, one of the um, one of the date, one of the the the, the date we, we, maybe maybe between the nine nine and ten and ninth century before uh, so. Um, well, we think to, we, we, this is a scientific project, but we need to transform this information, this scientific information to capture the people of the, the local people and also the young people from the schools, from the, the, and then we use two things we use in the, at the first um, place, we involve the community with uh, games, we work workshops, movies. Charles and uh, and uh, we create a small archaeological camp. So this is uh, some pictures of the we of the of the activities. So we use um, we teach we 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 have a workshop so of um, um, create. Uh, Stone, stone knife, uh, pottery, uh, and lots of, and, uh, for example, rock art ateliers with the with the chance. And uh, I show you another kind of uh, another kind of activities based also in the in the scientific data. In this case, it's also not also for the not also for the chance, but for the people of the community and the and the tourists, we create uh, based on the scientific data. We create the it's a kind of party. It's a medieval medieval uh, 
summer solstice. And uh, in this year, it, it was uh, very, very nice because we adapt at um, um, ancient uh, texts from the 60th century in England, in England. text uh, about uh, the, the solstice. So this is an example of the of the representation of this year. This is a a group of a theater group, name is Solo. So um, I bring a, a small video to show you. Uh, I don't know if you hear the sound of the video. Do you hear? Can you add tune? Do you hear the sound? No, just a moment. No, we don't. Oh. He just has to. It's on the. Yes, left side on the bottom. Manipulate video. Yeah. Uh, stop sharing and share again. Okay. Oops. I don't, understand, I don't understand how I put the sound of the video, but uh, I, we can, we, you can send it to me and then okay. I will share it with the people, the video, okay. yeah, we okay. can, or you give me the link for later. Okay. Try another. Yeah, just okay. go ahead with your presentation. Yes, go ahead, please. Okay. Okay, well, it's okay. So, so, so we, can, we create this um, small um, Yes. 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 E agora, ouvem? Continua, continua. Não, não ouvimos. Não, Por isso, se faz favor, avança. Está bem, pronto. Então. Obrigada. Well, the, the idea is to motivate. Um, the idea is to motivate the, the young people and the community to understand the, the scientific uh, speech and integrate this community with this kind of, uh, of projects and, uh, and this kind of place, because this is a very important place. This is very connecting. This is uh, very connecting with the nature. Do you hear me? Yes, 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 yes. yes. Perfect. OK, OK, so. Um, and um, the idea is uh, in the last uh, in the last year the the last year of the project is to create a, 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 to improve the valorization project to the site. So create uh, trails around the the, the 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 around the place and do all the archaeological materials and the archaeological information we will put on the 
um, archaeological center of Garganta is a is a, an old school from the village that uh, the municipality uh, transformed into like a, it's like a, a small museum, not only with the archaeological. Sorry. One or two minutes at most, please. Sorry. Sorry. Finish. Okay. So we go on a bit past uh, conclusion. Conclusion. Okay. okay. Thank you very much, okay. and uh, <laughs> have a good summer. <laughs>